What do you know of Barnabas Collins? Just legends, really. Two centuries ago, a witch turned him into a vampire and locked him away. See you in a couple centuries, lover boy. Madam, I am Barnabas Collins. You definitely find the world of Tim Burton in Dark Shadows. He's a visionary. He's a consummate filmmaker. And his vision, Tim, is his own genre. I really loved the script because it was very funny. It's just the world of Tim. I really wanted to do Dark Shadows because the thing that made Barnabas sort of unique is that he was a very reluctant vampire, which made it very different. We hit something. <laughs> I am terribly sorry. I cannot imagine how thirsty I am. <laughs> We said it in 1972. I was a you know teenager at that point, and you always try to find those kind of personal things that you can latch on to. And it was fun to just listen to the you know the sounds of 72. The idea of this very elegant man having been in a box for 200 years comes back to 1972. Maybe the worst time aesthetically in human existence. <laughs> what a great way to see the absurdity. It's a strange moment in time. What is that thing? It's a lamp. It looks like a pulsating blood urn. Is he for real? <laughs> Tim's vision is always so much fun to fulfill. He's traveling that strange, funny, dark, absurd world. Tim said something about when he went to cast the movie, he thought about the weird factor, which of course I love, <laughs> that he thought of me. <laughs> he loves to make it weirder and weirder. Oh, Welcome home, Barnabas Collins. How soon can the horses be ready? We don't have horses. We have a Chevy. And action! He's completely unique. There's no other way you can explain it. He's able to create a universe, you know, that is the world of Tim Burton. It's twisted, yet it has this element of fun. He's got such a sense of design as well as a storytelling aesthetic that are amazingly threaded together. You're kind of in there trying to concoct a new tone that sort of straddles humor. Mephistopheles. Melodrama, emotion, trying to mix it all up to create the Dark Shadows world. Barnabas, you're on fire. You never anticipate what's going to come out of Tim's head. And if Tim Burton comes knocking on the door and offers you a part, you don't really say no. I think it's probably the most fun I've seen Tim have on a set. We were just always laughing. Michelle keeps touching me, Tim. <laughs> Michelle keeps touching me. <laughs> Tim actually would sometimes laugh off camera in the middle of a take. Because everybody was so funny. It won't happen again. Uh, it was just really, really fun. What's exciting about Tim is that you can't imagine what he's going to do with Dark Shadows because he's so inventive. Tim's movies don't really fall into any one genre. They're a little bit of everything. Mr. Me. His thumbprint is yeah. on every frame of this movie. I know I love it. So to me, it's very exciting. He's just brilliant. Love me. Never. <laughs> was a regrettable turn of events. Are you stoned or something? They tried stoning me, my dear. It did not work. 